We've also got this great collaboration courtesy of Pata. Pata have collaborated with Nike um, for their Pata Running Club collection. Fucking hard. It features the Nike, it features the varsity jacket that obviously some of you have seen uh, Peggy Goo wear. I think she had it on her Instagram here, actually. Let me show you for those of you who haven't seen it. Peggy Goo actually had this amazing varsity jacket that I fucking want. That was fucking amazing. This varsity jacket here. Um, also, LeBron James was featured wearing it too. This varsity jacket is so fucking hard. Pata don't flop when it comes to these varsity jackets, right? It's got this black body, white sleeves, yellow, you know, accrued months all over the place. Massive, great fucking logos everywhere. And this is part of their running club collection fucking thing, right, going on. And it looks so fucking hard. So this is Nike and Pata running team collection. We'll, fake, we'll take it to the finishing line. You've got so great, a, a really expansive collection with Hirachis in there, um, jackets, hoodies, you know, sweatpants and shit like pff, fucking incredible really fucking well done and i think these colorways of the arachi and um, plus is actually an og it's actually a flip up an og this is that white pink one it's really fucking nice so again very unexpected model um a model i don't think that's been retro in a while i can't i don't think i retro i don't think they've retroed hirachis in a while hirachi pluses so it's actually a quite a good little flip so it says here nike and pata share their storied history and the others in the game while removed and like Ugh. for the next venture pata and nike are preparing for a marathon season across the performance heavy running collection the capsule range celebrates joint communities fast-paced accomplishments the pata running team is built on shared activities the unisex collection includes three previously teased air hirachi color Always hybridized with Air Plus uppers and Pegasus soles. The crossbreed sneaker boasts a leather and mesh construction. You know what's funny? There was a period in time where I went, I went to I think one run them crew thing. It's cool to see they're still going on. I thought the running club thing kind of died, but I was never a fan of running clubs. Like that was a thing in streetwear a few years ago that started. Everyone was kind of like making streetwear running clubs, and I fucking hate that shit. I want my separation. When I'm enjoying fashion, I want to enjoy my fashion crowd. When I'm enjoying street, I want to enjoy my streetwear crowd. I don't want to mix them. I don't want to go to like a fashion CrossFit class. You know what I mean? So that's why, but in general also, I'm not the best person to speak about these things because I hate group activities. So, you know, I went to, I think, a random crew thing once and, you know, all the fucking people, there was a DJ there, people talking while they were running and swapping Instagram. It's like, fuck this, bro. I want to run. I'm here to fucking sweat. I'm here to get a good fucking PR on my mile time. I'm here to shave some minutes off my fucking 5k i'm not here to fucking pontificate and share and network like that's fucking lame but some people love it and this pattern running crew has been happening i think probably about the same time that run them crew started or maybe even earlier but they're, they're still going strong so i guess you know people do love it but i hate group activities but the one thing to happen the one of the good things that come from this is obviously the, the clothes right the clothes are great because you know these teams usually have good link ups with the brands and shit and they get together and they make these incredible things like this varsity is so hard like, i'd wear this in an instant and again i'm not really the biggest fan of like nike branded varsity jackets they seem sometimes a little bit too in your face but i love this these patches are fucking great massive i don't know if it's like a black tiger or that's like a leopard i don't know what that is or what with this x with the swoosh on it looks fucking great great construction the tracksuit is really fucking beautiful too you got night you got pata and nike on the seams here in the yellow and then obviously that creamy colorway like fucking hell it looks so fucking good all of it looks really fucking good i love it love all of it i'd wear the whole entire thing and i think it's all i think the best colorway obviously the harachi is this white and pink one um, the black colorway is okay. The black and gray one, not too bad. But I think the best colorway definitely is that white Is that white and pink. That white and pink is fucking smoking. And also this yellow and blue. Yellow and blue is also one of two, two of the best ones on there. But that varsity is definitely the winner. The varsity looks good on fucking everybody. It's a little bit oversized in terms of the shape, but I do fucking like it. Let's see the release date. Um, it says here, take a closer look at the Nike and Nike collection and gallery above. It says to drop on Pata April 26th and May 2nd through Nike. And the pink Karachi colorways are being... Oh, the pink one's a Pata exclusive. No wonder. The one I like the most is a Pata exclusive, this one. Lame. So I guess the only ones you could get are the yellow and the black ones are going to be available as a GR. But the pink ones are Pata exclusive. That's annoying. They're really nice though. Really fucking nice. I expect them to sell out too. So big up Pata. Big up fucking pata okay big up pata 